Nam is, is, comes from a, a Sanskrit word, uh, namus. It's a devotion or a fusion of your life with the law. Myoho means mystic law. Mystic because it includes the things we don't yet understand as well as the things that we do understand. Renge is lotus, representing simultaneous cause and effect. Why? Well, the lotus flower is really beautiful and it grows in a swamp. But its seeds, the cause, are right on top of the flower, the effect. This is why it represents simultaneous cause and effect. Life is not easy, especially today. And I'm sure we can all agree, we live in the muck and mire of a difficult world. At the same time, there's an undeniable beauty to the essence of life. And we all have the infinite capacity, infinite capacity to create a beautiful life and manifest the light of advancement by turning poison into medicine. But what does simultaneous cause and effect mean? It means that the effect is inherent in the cause, but it may take some time to manifest. Kyo literally means sutra or teaching. But on a, on a deeper level, it's the true teaching expressed through the sound of one's voice or, or the sounds and vibrations of the universe. It encompasses one's awakening to a true understanding of the law. And this is wisdom. You know, we hear a lot about information and knowledge these days. When's the last time you heard the word wisdom? There's a huge difference between knowledge and wisdom. A person with a lot of knowledge can be smart, but a smart person isn't necessarily wise. My phone is smart. But I wouldn't want it to make serious decisions for me. My life mentor, SCI's President Ikeda, says, wisdom is stimulated by compassion. He says, quote, let us give something to each person we meet, joy, courage, hope, assurance, or philosophy, wisdom, a vision for the future. Let's always give something, end quote. This is his wisdom stimulated by his compassion. President Educator also said, quote, we are not born into this world to suffer and be miserable. We are born to be happy and savor true joy, never allowing any suffering or misfortune to defeat us. This is the essential message of the Lotus Sutra." End quote. The Lotus Sutra is one of the most compassionate and significant scriptures of Nichiren, Buza, Buddha, Nichiren Buddhism that says, absolute happiness is inherent in all life. All of us possess the Buddha nature. And the attainment of enlightenment is open to all people as they are. To me, the purpose of my faith is to nurture feelings of empowerment and vitality, encourage a sense of personal infinite power, value, and limitless potential, and in the process reveal that every one of us has this ability. There's no ego involved, no comparisons to others. And, and if you're moving forward and growing, you naturally want to help others realize their dreams and happiness. We find those qualities 
in the jazz experience too. Every human being experiences suffering. And one of life's pivotal challenges is how to turn a negative experience into something of value. When you fall into the ground, use the ground to get back up again.